And we're back live with another edition of Break the Chains News and Info. I'm your host, Corey, and I just wanted to bring up something real quick. I was doing a little bit of research online, looking through all the weather maps and projected plans of the hurricane systems, Maria, Jose, and just the general low-pressure system of the Atlantic. And I was looking up on Ventus Sky again, and i got to show you guys this. This is kind of weird. I'm no weatherman. I'm no expert. And this could easily just be a flub in the computer system that is the program, or Ventus Sky itself maybe misreading things or projecting wrong, or I'm not too, too sure. But from what it looks like, it just looks strange. This is Friday the 22nd. This is Hurricane Jose. This is Hurricane Maria. Okay? And this is obviously the Atlantic. You got this big low pressure system here. Okay? If you notice, you got this cyclonic behavior here, moves out. There's this kind of a shaped pattern here. Okay? We're going to move forward a day. Low pressure system moves up, the arm kind of reaches down. Jose's here. Okay? Arm, Jose. 24th. Arm disappears, or at least falls far to the east into Ireland, and the low pressure system rises up. Okay? We're getting a new one being pushed down. Low pressure system here. Okay? Arms dissipated, or kind of moves moved this way. Okay? 25th. Low pressure system moves east. This band appears. This band appears. Maria moves up towards the east coast. 26th strengthens strengthens now also notice this this is strengthening as well okay and you have this movement coming from the north into this area but wait what's this what's this thing what's this 27th large cyclonic behavior up on the north here arm reaching down we got this arm reaching down again into the Atlantic Maria's here arm here. Again, low pressure system moves north, arm reaches down. What is this? What is this? This is Thursday, Thursday the 28th. What is this? All right, load up for me. What is this? It goes from this straight here Kind of rides this straight all look at this up into Iceland Iceland kind of where it originates Iceland okay this moves down through the strait off the coast of Spain and Portugal ac across the Atlantic all the way through okay then you have all these like finger fingers kind of reaching out okay it'll you get a little you get a little spiral here you get a little low here okay and again reaching towards Maria, okay? 29th. Maria. Wait, what's this? What's this? You got an arm reaching down. Remember when we said through uh, through um, the strait and through Iceland? That arm kind of moved over this way. And you have this, kind of maybe a remnant of that previous arm. But then you have this. This low pressure moving towards this. Okay, let's zoom in and watch this. This is what really bothered me. What is this pattern, folks? What is this pattern? I am no meteorologist. I am no weatherman by any stretch. But this just, I, I can't call this nothing, you know? You've got this strong low pressure system right here off the coast of Ireland moving through this strait again and then the arm reaching all the way across the northern Atlantic okay look at that reaching directly into Maria okay not not a strong storm not a strong storm but it's being pulled away it's being pulled eastward we'll go we'll go forward to one more day um, onto the first okay see how that like it's just like little little spiral little dots little you know areas of calmness within this low pressure I don't know. Go to the first here. What is that? 
What is that? Okay? I don't know. You got a big low pressure here between Iceland and the, the Isles here. Low pressure. Okay? You got the movement of this, what I can't figure it out. And it goes directly, grabs right the eye. Right at the eye. Look at that. But comparing it between day to day, I mean, this is obviously still a projection, but. Speeds aren't much, I mean, speeds are a little higher, but look at how far it pulled it eastward. From here, pulled it this far. Um, that's, a de that's a decent distance in 24 hours. And you got this pull, this, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of at a loss for words right now, folks, but I just noticed that and noticed that there's no more recurring hurricanes below. For, for about six to eight weeks, we just kept seeing hurricanes form off the coast here of Africa and move their way this way, okay? Move their way this way. But now we're seeing this pulling them up and away. I I don't know. Those arms that reach down towards Hurricane Jose and Hurricane Maria could be naturally forming. However, I think there's more at play. We've got geoengineering, weather modification, harp, stratospheric aerosol injections that manipulate and change weather patterns it's all been disclosed so i think that there's something larger at foot here that's kind of what i wanted to mention to you if you liked this kind of investigative slash weather journalism we're going to be doing a lot more i know hurricanes are kind of a big thing now but i want to get into discussions a little bit more about social issues a little bit more about politics a little bit more about life liberty and the pursuit of all good things and all things that we need to kind of be focusing on. Just really quick, I wanted to introduce you to my my, uh, my special news reporter here. This is my son, Alexander. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. This is Corey and... Alexander. Alexander, and we are signing off for Break the Chains News and Info. Stay tuned, stay in touch, and most importantly... Be safe out there, people. Be safe.